Hello, in this video, we're going to talk about leflutamide, the pharmacology of leflutamide, which is a popular disease modifying anti rheumatic drug. Leflutamide is an immunosuppressant used to treat rheumatoid arthritis and psoriatic arthritis. It is also used to treat neurological conditions, uh, including multiple sclerosis. Leflutamide is a prodrug that is rapidly and almost completely metabolized following oral administration to its pharmacologically active metabolite, A771726, or teriflutamide. The mechanism of action of leflutamide has not been fully determined, but appears to primarily inhibit the mitochondrial enzyme dihydroorotate dehydrogenase. T cells require nucleotides to proliferate, especially pyrimidines. Resting lymphocytes use the salvage pathway for pyrimidine synthesis. However, activated T cells use de novo pathway of pyrimidine synthesis. De novo pathway of pyrimidine synthesis allows for DNA and RNA synthesis, which is important for activated T cell to proliferate. Inhibition of dihydroorotate dehydrogenase by teriflutamide essentially prevents production of pyrimidines by the de novo pathway. Such inhibition leads to decreased pyrimidine synthesis, decreasing DNA and RNA synthesis. Because leflutamide inhibits pyrimidine synthesis, it thus prevents the T cell, in this case the autoimmune T cell, from progressing to the S phase where DNA replication occurs. It doesn't have any pyrimidines to make new DNA. The autoimmune T cells are arrested in the G1 phase of the cell cycle. It is through this action that leflutamide inhibits autoimmune T cell proliferation and subsequently production of autoantibodies by B cells. Patients must be monitored for side effects of hepatotoxicity and myelosuppression. Peripheral neuropathy can occur with leflutamide and is usually self-limited if the drug is discontinued. Leflutamide, just like methotrexate, is teratogenic and should not be used in pregnancy. If severe side effects occur or a patient becomes pregnant unexpectedly while on leflutamide, stopping the drug and consideration of cholestyramine washout can be done. Cholestyramine is a non-absorbed bile acid sequestrant that is used to treat hyperlipidemia. It essentially helps with the elimination of leflutamide from the body because even after stopping leflutamide, leflutamide has a long half-life of three weeks. Leflutamide is eliminated from the hepatic biliary system with bile acids. Leflutamide with the bile acids in the small intestines could be readily reabsorbed, thus increasing the uh, prolonged effect of leflutamide in the body. Cholestyramine resins absorbs and combines with the bile acids in the intestine to form an insoluble complex which is excreted in the feces. This results in a partial removal of bile acids and the leflutamide from the enterohepatic circulation by preventing their absorption essentially.